Charles Manson was a CIA chump, entrusted with cutting down the 1960s flower child development which was viewed as a temperate and sociological danger to both the administration and its Vietnam War. On 9 August 1969, a eight-month pregnant Sharon Tate alongside four of her Tinseltown companions were severely killed at the Hollywood home she imparted to director Roman Polanski. Prepare for Change.net reports, it is generally trusted that these were ceremonial killings requested by the famous Charles Manson and completed by his devotees the Manson family. Be that as it may, government informant Charles August Schlund III, also called Chuck Schlund, recommends that these homicides may have truth be told, been a secretive operation completed by the CIA. Schlund, now expired, ran over the Werebowls papers amid the 70s which, in addition to other things, gave data on the CIA's inclusion in the Manson family murders. Schlund really recorded a claim against George W. Bramble, for unlawful endeavors, upon his individual, to smother this data, however this never went to trial. Schlund claims that the CIA's prime goal, at the time, was to expose the nonconformist development which was ended up being an efficient and sociological danger to both the legislature and its Vietnam War exertion. The war was going severely and the American individuals were challenging in ever more noteworthy numbers with pictures of beautiful bloom young ladies on TV daily, dissenting. The CIA required a method for demonstrating the American individuals that these entirely little bloom young ladies were truly Satanists and abhorrent and that the administration was correct and just in the war. To do this the administration expected to lead a huge undercover operation to persuade the American individuals that these little blossom young ladies were underhanded, and the free love and peace they talked of was truly to conceal insidious. Schlund recommends that Charles Manson was, truth be told, a social trial and that the CIA had not exclusively been providing medications to the Manson family yet additionally financing their living. It's a well-known fact that the CIA frequently tried different things with drugs with sides set on mass personality control. Nkultra is one of their most well-known tasks and Manson was in jail at the time they were known to utilize detainees at Vacaville jail in the Nkultra tests. Tex Watson relative and one of the sentenced Tate LaBianca murderer, asserted that in the months paving the way to the murders the Manson family had all been taking a medication called Orange Sunshine which was made and dispersed solely by a gathering known as the Brotherhood of Eternal Love where one of the merchants Ronald Stark had known associations with the CIA. There is no uncertainty the Manson family were under a type of mind control, in the book, Helter Skelter, Manson's prosecutor Vincent Bugliosi talks inside and out, of Manson's mind control capacities, and cases they are practically identical with those utilized by the U.S. military. Again proposing that he may have been a result of the CIA. On the off chance that Schlund's claims were genuine that the CIA objective was to expose the radical development the repercussions of the Tate LaBianca murderer absolutely recommended they had achieved their target. As Vincent Bugliosi told the Observer Daily Paper in 2009, the Manson murders sounded the passing chime for hipsters and all they emblematically spoke to. They shot a period. The 60s, the time of affection, finished on that night, on August 9, 1969. Despite the fact that there is no physical proof of the Ware Bowles papers there is physical confirmation for Operation Northwood this record demonstrates the CIA proposition to the Kennedy Organization to confer demonstrations of fear on U.S. subjects trying to reprimand Cuba and this way legitimize a war, your newswire additionally as of late investigated the admission of a 78-year-old CIA operator guaranteeing to have done 37 affiliations included Marilyn Monroe. With this confirmation we have to keep a receptive outlook on what Schlund guaranteed.